What's up everybody, welcome back. You know, the biggest problem I have with making these videos is the intro because sometimes they get to be three, four, five minutes long. So I'm gonna try to keep this under a minute. This tank is just okay. It has a trophy system because that's what America has and that's all I can ever remember. It's the anti-AGM, ATGM missile defeat. You have two chargers on each side. If you expand the chargers on one side, you'll have to expand the others on the other side. In the bottom for your tank description, it'll show you how many charges you have left on each side. The gun is okay. It's 120 millimeters with 564 millimeters of pin once you get the L27A1, which is just okay. You're gonna have to hit tanks a couple times to take them out. The armor, for the most part, is again okay because the turret obviously is well protected the top of the lower hole is well protected but once we get to the side here we can see that there is a huge hole here and the ammo i know it's hard to see but you're getting hit here you can get ammo racked you can get crew taken out whatever the case may be if we go back to the armor view we've got 72 at best i would say is 90 millimeters of protection depending on how your tank is at you can get higher but that's going to be for planes and stuff right there so for the most part the tank is okay acceleration reverse is just again okay you're never going to be the first one to the cap unless you're playing with all tortoises or something slower than you so it has laser warning system and a whole bunch of other modifications that you would normally expect on a modern mbt smoke grenades ess it does have gen 3 thermals which are a huge boost considering that you are you know hopefully gonna be taking stuff out at a distance with that being said i hope you guys enjoy today's video Well, we'll see how well this thing handles stuff. Nice Gen 2 thermals. Okay, so... First experience is, this thing is slow. There, let's see... I don't, I'm gonna, yeah, no, I don't know where it is. This thing is very, very slow. does not have the normal movements that I expect from like an Abrams so this being the first top tier British that I've ran it would only make sense I'm not 100% sure how much I can actually push it I don't know where that's coming from. That's 
dead. I'm trying to push forward. Thank you. I'm trying, bud. I'm trying. dead and it looks alive the enemy is winning so I'm guessing the one and two down on the tactical icon is the charges for the trophy system or whatever it is. I can't remember what the Brits called it. Attention to the map. Attention to the map. Attention to the designated grid square. Okay. Yeah. Okay, yep, I can now confirm that the uh, the dial around us on the bottom left is charges on our defensive systems. Really, that's all we have is a little 30 caliber. No, that's a. F is that? I don't know what that is. Yeah, that's not 50. out of this. There's somebody in front of me. And there was. Make sure hill's clear. I hear I hear him. get him out of this situation. Can't 
don't see it. Okay, if it's there, it's dead, hopefully. Let's just try to decap it. Get that going at least. I don't think we need to continue the push. I think we need to secure what we have. Kind of just hold. Everything down in the south dead. Oh, it just hit me with a laser. It might have been a friendly. I don't know what's hitting me with a laser. Getting a laser. Oh, it's a helicopter. Right? I'm out of chargers on this side. Okay, well, he's out. We're out of charges, so we're on a repair. Okay, so I guess we're going to see if we can recharge the defensive systems. Attention to the map. I think that's another helicopter, yep. Just gonna sit here for a second. I don't know if it's gonna recharge the. I'm guessing it is, because I've never seen a missile icon for something that doesn't have a missile. But that's gonna be a long reload. And I'm not gonna screw with that KA 50. I'll just keep dropping that so that he can't have an opportunity. Now, the question is is it going to refill all of it? or one because that's what I'll be wondering about so we're going to go ahead and let this fill out does reloading, reloading. no it doesn't post that stat Attention to the map. it's almost there I'm guessing we'll get one charge Yep, one charge. Man, that's a long reload for one charge. But what they have left is helicopters. It's all right. If I don't do it, somebody needs to. Got 
Got him. First strike. Oh, and that was a TAM, too. That's that's beautiful. Got him. Got him. I think I dropped smoke. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Attention to the map. Yeah, we're backing up. Got it. I'm not sure if that means that there's something there or what. Attention to the designated grid square. Somebody cover me. Yes, a hit. Need backup. Yeah, he's there, I guess. I am. And I can't do anything to damage the... See anything? F4E just took out... Damn, dude. Hmm. Well, we've got enough on that side. I'm gonna go this way. Just died. right in front of me oh yeah I don't think this is really worth it to bring the back up but you never know I know that Abrams is dead right now awesome. somebody already killed it that's what I mean Where? 
What do you got, bro? So it was worth it to bring it. I got to get that guy, so. All in all, I think the Black Knight is a decent MBT. I would like it if it had a little bit more speed, or at least acceleration. Getting up and moving is slow, so you're going to have to be prepared for that. You're not just going to instantly take off. Gun is good. Armor is meh. I mean, compared to everything else that you're fighting, it's meh. Having the... I'm going to call it the trophy system because that's what they have on the American tanks and that's what I remember it as. Excellent. Um, it works pretty well. I'm impressed with it. I think that it is a nice addition to the game and that it will add a lot onto future MBTs, especially the, the Abrams once we see it. But with that, yeah. With that, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. We'll be doing more of the vehicles that we have from the test drive as the week comes. I'm not sure what order I'm gonna do it in. There might be some more Israel tanks and we're getting more and more of those unlocked and available to us. So with that, everyone have a great time with the patch and the update and we will catch you in the next video.